1. Gravity does not exist. Okay, so I have to start here because flat earthers really say this. One of the biggest lies believed by all people of the world for generation after generation is the one involving gravity. When I tell people that gravity doesn't exist, they look at me as if I were a madman. It's hard to know exactly what they mean by this because it is so obviously false. When pressed, they will admit that objects are always pulled down, but they will make up all sorts of excuses about what it is that causes this that are other than gravity. I will address these individually, but for the purposes of this video, when I say gravity, I simply mean that common universal observation that things are pulled down. We can all agree that that occurs. It doesn't really matter what you call it. We will talk about the cause of gravity later, but we first need to agree that the downward pull we all experience is real. And we call that downward pull gravity. If you don't agree that things are pulled down, please see a psychiatrist as soon as possible. You are delusional. It should be easy. You can just float to one. So really, flat earthers accept that there is a downward pull, but their real problem is with the direction of the pull. Apparently, they think that there is just a universal down direction and a universal up direction, and things just want to go down. Well, that is simply not the case, and literally tons of evidence proves otherwise, as I will show. When talking about gravity on Earth, down is toward the center of mass of the Earth. I think they are getting confused with different uses of the words up and down. We tend to say up north and down south, but that has nothing to do with gravity. That is just a human convention that came out of the way we make maps. A map like this looks wrong, but there is technically nothing wrong about it. We are just used to seeing a map with north at the top. It helps us to have a consistent way to look at maps. So north is oriented at the top and south at the bottom. But that choice was arbitrary. It had nothing to do with gravity. There is no force south of the South Pole pulling on things. Nothing. Nada. South is not down in the scientific sense. Really, children understand this, yet many adult flat earthers amazingly somehow do not understand this. The pull of gravity near the Earth is always directed toward the center of the Earth. I will talk about the tremendous evidence for this fact. 